we are running apparently to Zen. Funny story with this restaurant. Jadi setiap kali aku tanya teman-teman di Singapore, what's one restaurant that I must eat at? Mereka semua bilang Zen. Tapi memang Zen tuh mahal banget. Jadi aku dan guys tuh kayak back and forth, back and forth. Should we try? Should we not? Gitu kan. Tapi they recently got awarded, I think from two stars to three stars Michelin. So we were like, okay, I understand the price point. And one drunken night, I just went on laptop and I was like, okay, let me just put this on the waiting list. Soalnya reservasinya tuh bener-bener penuh nuh nuh sampai bulan November or something. So gue kayak nggak ingat gitu loh that I put myself on the waiting list. Jadi for a whole week, I had Zen Saturday, September 18th on my Google Calendar. Then gue kayak nanya semua orang, why do I have Zen on my Google Calendar? And my Google Calendar is my Bible basically. I follow it like to the T. Si Oda gue iseng-iseng coba dap on Zen and they were like, oh yeah, we have you on the waiting list for Saturday. Um, but let me check if we can actually give you a spot for two people. Terus gue kayak, huh? Masa iya gitu? And this was yesterday. Terus dia bilang kayak, okay, we have a spot tomorrow for you. Terus kita gue kayak, oh my god, babe. We're trying Zen tomorrow. Anyway, I'm wearing with love collab. Ini udah semoga udah bisa dibeli. Sama bawahnya juga with love collab. Let's go. This is the restaurant. We were looking for it. And literally the name is right here, Zen. Kayak susah banget liatnya kalau dari mobil. Cantik banget sih entrance-nya. It looks like a dystopian little restaurant. Tadi kita kan baru di offer beverage gitu kan. Dia bilang mau alcoholic, non-alcoholic, or just water. Gue kayak, water. We are hungover, just siap ketawa. Oh, you're hungover, big night, eh? We're like, yeah. Anyway, ini tempatnya bagus banget. Jadi dia tuh konsepnya kayak lagi makan di living roomnya orang. Jadi kita tuh lagi duduk di sofa dan meja di depan kita tuh kayak coffee table gitu, kayak bukan meja yang tinggi. Yeah, I already tried it, so here it goes. Good, eh? Very well balanced, yeah. Mm. <laughs> oh, let's see the hand gestures. <laughs> Very fishy. Yeah. Right there, mm. king crab in there. Like it's like a bit buttery, but you know, it's yeah. not butter. And also, we got that like crispy from the tart kanape, still hungover. A little mm -hmm. less hungover because of that kanape right there. Mm. Oh, guys, look at that. It's filled to the brim with like kayak semacam tobiko gitu dalamnya. Wow, interesting. Mm. There's like some seaweed in there or something. So many flavors. Ada asam, ada fishy lagi, ada crispy, a little bit of some seaweed. Like slightly of, 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 of bau taste, yeah. Bau like cheesy. Like cheesy, yeah. Yeah. Pokoknya enak deh, sensory experience. I would like to invite you a little closer to the ingredients. Gonna showcase a bit of them in your raw form and just briefly yes. talk about this. Yeah. Okay. Katanya ini their take on mala. Let's try it. Mm. You like it? Yeah, I taste the uh, what you mean by mala. Yeah. Sancho pepper, yes. Yeah, the sancho comes through. Mm. Gently, it's not like in your the end. Kalau yang ini ada jalapeno nya, terus ada vinegar yang katanya is a vinegar 10 years old. Yes. Vinegar is 10 years old, so let's try. <laughs> Everything is good. It's good in your own ways, right? Mm. Like, I can appreciate every single one. This is a lighter one, yeah. My hangover is totally going away. Thank you very much. <laughs> this is the jewel. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> we have the Majima truffle. Yep. So the dessert's gonna have a hundred year old balsamic vinegar from House of Yusti. Last one, ini katanya ada black currant oil, terus isinya ada foie gras sama unagi. Mm. 
Biasa orang kan suka surf foie gras emang sama berry jam kan Ini mereka tuh kayak merubah berry jamnya nggak cuma jam doang Tapi dia taro black currantnya di atas apple Jadi those little balls that you see Those are little apple balls dipped in black currant oil And so wow, it's just umami, you got the fresh, you got the juicy It's good, it's like exceeding my expectations Exceeding, and we, biasa, and we had high expectations Karena biasa makanan yang cantik-cantik itu tuh gak enak yeah. Ini enak gitu Very lovely room for you. Wow, ini bagus banget. Kayak semuanya bagus gitu. Bingung, hai. Gak bagus banget. Thank you. If I could use one word to describe this restaurant so far, it would be warm. Like warm service. The food is good. The decor is also warm. Lots of wood. Very zen, according to the name. Yeah, it's not like very like pretentious. Yeah. Not like. Jujur, ganti pasti <laughs> Karena kalau dengar gastronomia, pasti mikir kayak, oh makanannya pasti yang cantik-cantik doang Yang ada dry ice, tapi, you know what I mean? Like, when there may be dry ice later. There may be dry ice, but the dry ice is gonna be tasty <laughs> Ini gak di-endorse ya? We're just sharing our pure experience as we're experiencing it Biar kalian bisa berasa kalian tuh lagi bener di sini bareng sama kita gitu The decor So beautiful, the decor we're supposed to spread the wasabi around and then eat it. Oh my gosh, this looks exquisite. Just so delicately made and made right in front of us. So we know exactly what's in it. Let's try. I'm so excited. Really good. Again, you feel the sea in your mouth. Walaupun dia itu banyak banget seafoodnya ya, ada kaviarnya, ada sashiminya, ada tartarnya, tapi nggak ada rasa-rasa amis, fresh banget. Jadi ini katanya tuh scallop di bawahnya ada uni hot sauce ya, kalau nggak salah dengar. Terus ada ikurannya lagi, dan ada nggak tahu apa deh, pokoknya makan aja yuk, makan aja. Scallopnya pas di tusuk tuh tender dan juicy banget, ini udah ketahuan banget nih guys, ini cooked to a perfect temperature. Babe, <laughs> speechless gak sih? <laughs> Jarang banget liat guys kayak gini, guys susah banget untuk di impress tau gak sih? Gila ya babe? I'm gonna be speechless this whole experience. Yeah, aku belum pernah lihat scallop setebal ini. Here's my finger for comparison. Bagian tengahnya tuh kayak masih mentah gitu. Rasanya tuh bener-bener just out of this world. Mixed with the ikura, oh my gosh, this is my favorite so far. This vinegar is still 25 years old. 25 year old is a bit younger, my age. Ini truffle-nya bener-bener generous ya. I like the balsamic vinegar. Oh, it adds something? Wow. It's savory. It's, it's sweet and savory. It reminds me of a really thick mushroom soup. Mm. I was expecting more sweetness. I'm enjoying this too though. Good. Okay, menarik banget nih guys. Jadi dia tuh kayak rada keras gitu. I want to have everything in one bite. Mm. It's very good. Dingin ya. Creamy, ada berry-nya, which I love berry desserts. It's my favorite type of desserts. Kind of like a deconstructed cheesecake. The balsamic vinegar is a nice touch. Mm. Should I try this? Karangi. Mm. <laughs> oh, you guys hear that crunchiness? Garing loh. Good. Good. Could even match this actually. Cepat ya, sama ini bukan wine ya? Oke, okay, jadi kita pindah ke lantai tiga. Ini namanya living room ya. Hey, we got the pink sofa. <laughs> ini 
inspirasi interior design banget nih guys tempatnya bener-bener cantik jadi atasnya tuh kayak semacam attic gitu Jadi ini tuh ada shisho sama apa beb? Christmas tree. Dia bilang kalau baunya kayak Christmas tree jangan kaget ya, soalnya memang seharusnya seperti itu. <laughs> This is exactly like that shisho leaf in KBBQ. And the fact that it's cold, ice cream, gelato. <laughs> Mm. Sweet, yeah, sweet looks good. Look at the peach. We need to do that for our guests next time. Mmm! Boishi. This grape that looks fake but isn't fake. This fruit is so good. Katanya sih ini terakhir ya untuk dessert. <laughs> yeah, after this will be like a uh, sambal wagyu stick. <laughs> we'll be like, mm, bye bye. <laughs> ini ada dark chocolate, ini ada pineapple, ini katanya garlic licorice. Ooh. Menarik sekali ini aku udah lupa semuanya cuma kita <laughs> coba aja. You know what I really appreciate all the different plates, but they all really complement each other, and I feel like I'm learning a lot about like hospitality as well from eating at fine dining restaurants. I really think inspiration can come from everywhere. Let's try this. Mm. What is that? Mm. It's kapal, salted caramel. Oh, this is so good. I love stuff that's dark chocolate, salted caramel, nutty, very very delicious. Next we have a pineapple shoe. Mm. It's okay, not my favorite because there's like a herb in there that I don't like. Garlic licorice. It's very interesting. It's like a garlic ham. Mm. It's shaped exactly like a garlic club. I don't feel like I'm eating like corn me or something because of the garlic. It's like dipping just a little bit of garlic inside caramel. Mm. This kind of reminds me of like okay, an old-fashioned cocktail. Jadi ada bitternya, ada smokinya, tapi terus ada manisnya juga. Going to lunch at Ayoki. Alright, very discreet looking door. This place called Ayoki. I haven't been here in four years or more. Last time I was here was with my mom. It's my first time. It's his first time. Then we were just like, "Oh, jam satu dua puluh, tuh tuh loh ya harus buru buru kesini juga. Sekarang dulu. Kita sampai nggak pakai MRT langsung. Okay, order Gojek. So now we're here. We made it in time. It's twelve thirty-eight now. So ample time to eat. Oh yeah, like the yukaku pudding. If it is, then we're being overcharged. Let's see. It is? Which is better though? This is more complex. Oh, okay. <laughs> MS makeup. Oh my gosh. It actually looks really beautiful. Guess how much one lipstick is? Uh, $300. Okay, like 200 plus. Not bad, not bad. Not bad, not bad. Kita sekarang lagi ada di Tang's department store. Di sini ada semua merek-merek, bahkan ada Christian Louboutin. Tapi nggak tahu kenapa aku tuh kayak nggak ada keinginan beli gitu loh. Rasanya tuh kayak udah kebanyakan makeup kali ya di Jakarta. Very blessed though to say that. Oh gosh, I love Tom Ford fragrances. Packaging. I feel like they have a new packaging. It's like kind of made of wood. What you looking at there? <laughs> like you belajar texture, pasti. Yeah, dude. Feels expensive. There's so much the texture. Yeah. Kita bahkan pegang-pegang ininya. <laughs> like what is this made of? Semua nonton Shang-Chi. I feel like I'm the most excited one. I don't know why. I think because it's an Asian superhero for once. Yeah, Asian representation. Dan udah lama banget gak nonton disini guys Next 
Coklat baru buka dari LA dan lihat deh ini ngantrinya ke sana. <laughs> ini kita lagi di Foot Locker, which is like an American sneaker store. Oh, your Jordans. That's nice. It's too orange for me. I want something that's like a beige color. Tapi gimana ya guys, Air Jordan kalau dipakai cewek akan kelihatan pendek deh ya kakinya. Yang ini keren nih guys, warna putih. Terus aku suka logonya juga kayak very discreet gitu. Selalu ya sepatu cowok-cowok tuh lebih bagus. Guys, lihat ini sneakernya lucu banget. Is it for men? I have no idea, but you can probably get a small size for women. Yeah, I get it. It's actually really cute. It will match a lot of colors because like if you go and with, it makes like... you taller. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, I actually really like this. Try them on. I just like them. Typical guys, nggak suka belanja. Like visually. Ya, lucu banget timbalans buat cewek. Terus lihat deh Converse-nya tuh bener-bener hype banget. Wow, that's actually like crazy. I've never seen those Converse's before. And look at these Crocs. Crocs are making a comeback. Yeah, now that like ugly dad sneakers are back in, jadinya sepatu yang cantik ini lagi ngapain lagi. By the way, ini section buat cewek semua. Beli nggak? <laughs> Beli nggak? sneakers and the first store so we're checking out another store ini tuh ada t-shirts dan ada teh juga <laughs> lucu banget konsepnya tada di sini juga banyak nih sepatu-sepatu yang hype sebenarnya aku nggak mau sepatu hype juga sih aku mau sepatu buat sehari-hari aja wah wow, ini banyak banget di sini uh, yang itu bagus dia kayak Air Jordan tapi warnanya lebih muted tiba-tiba melihat toko lagi ini aku baru beli baju di Uniqlo langsung pakai ini bagus banget sih tokonya kayak super rapih gitu tertata ini di Somerset capeknya aku jongkok guys liatin tasnya lucu saya Justin Bieber apa music video dari zaman dulu you need to throw it towards the center thank you very obvious uh. So I have a little bit of time before my grab car gets here And I wanted to show you guys my OOTD as always Ini aku lagi pakai Curve X Second Date Collab Kayaknya ini masih available deh di e-commerce kita Tapi harus beli dengan root note Tapi jangan takut kalau beli sama root note Harganya tuh bakal kayak diskon banget gitu loh So super worth it I love this dress so much Karena mau body type apapun tuh bikin pinggang kelihatan kecil Dan bikin pinggul kelihatan bagus And I'm wearing Netflix lip tint and kasih Pale gel lip gloss, and I'm also wearing Rude Nude eyeshadow palette. Kalau misalnya aku bisa namain satu look second date, this would be the look. Understated, but with a little bit of pops of glam here and there. Terus kayak beda dari orang lain gitu loh. Kayak there's something there that makes you stand out. Like for example, for me today would be like the berry lips and the minimal dress, but I'm accessorizing. So yeah, super happy with all of second date's products. This is just one big commercial. So anyway, I'm going to my friend's Ray's wedding. I've actually never met the bride, but we have talked on video call before. So I'm very excited to meet them and also some of my university friends. So let's go. Congrats, Ray! Hi, Thanks. <laughs> He's a groomsman. Look at him. Looking 
is so cute in his vest. Uh, sir, can I have a refill of my white wine, please? Is that one? Yeah, it's one. Oh my gosh, you look so cute. Oh, you see this? What? Dumpling. Dumpling bit on it? Oh my gosh, she followed you all the way to Singapore. <laughs> 